Mark Twitchell is like some fucking cringy ass screenwriter who writes terrible fucking scripts or whatever, and he gets absolutely obsessed with the show Dexter, as you do. And he's like, sure. oh, I want to be Dexter. I want to be a fucking serial killer slash cannibal slash. I don't. I've never seen Dexter. I think that's all he does. Mm -hmm. Um, but anyway, so he like rents out. Oh, his you fucking... heard. <laughs> He like rents out this fucking garage or something or whatever, and he like fills this thing with uh, plastic so that he can kill somebody in it and like cut up the Why body. Why wolves hurt? Uh, and the way he finds his victim is by using an online dating site and fucking catfishing some dude to come and like, hey man, you wanna fuck? Uh, and so this dude shows up. And Mark Twitchell, the absolute fucking dumbass, assumes that killing somebody in real life is like killing somebody in a movie or a TV show. So he like hits him in the back of the head with a uh, with like a cattle prod, and the guy he's like, oh my god, the guy was surprised. He fought back and escaped. And so instead of like going to the police, this guy just did nothing. Wild. You know, Wait, like, oh, the man who got that, like, like assaulted by a cra by, with a cattle prod didn't go to the police. Exactly. What? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. It's like, so, oh, you know, Mark it's just a typical Tuesday, man. So Mark Twitchell is like freaking out for a little while about this. He's like, oh my god, oh I'm gonna get found out already, two minutes in. And uh, hey, does anybody have arrows? I do. Oh, what kind of arrows and did you want? And instead what happens is nothing happens. So Twitchell decides to try again and get this. The same guy <laughs> fucking shows up. He cat got catfished oh! twice. The same yeah, no. guy. You don't want to shoot at that. Like this, he catfishes the same guy again. And yet again hits him in the head with like a pipe. Same guy as last time. Hits him in the head with a pipe. Guy fights back, but this time Twitchell brought a gun, so he kills the guy. And then, as he's trying to dispose of the body, he's like, wait, shit, this is not like in the movies either. This is actually kind of fucking gruesome or whatever. So he tries to, like, dissolve the body in acid, but he does a terrible job. Uh, and eventually... Eventually he gets caught by the police because... The guy who he killed's car was left outside of the garage because Twitchell couldn't drive stick. <laughs> what the fuck? So he made up some bullshit story about how he bought the car from some guy for 40 bucks because this guy was running off to live with some hot chick in fucking Bermuda or whatever. So, you know, the cops were like, uh, dude, seriously? Hmm. And the best part is, he also wrote all of this in a journal. Everything. Just written down in a journal. He even told his wife all of this. <laughs> and his wife didn't go to the cops either. Uh, it's just a fucking mess. This dude's a fucking dumbass. Obviously, damn. And apparently he was going to attempt to eat part of the body, but was like, yeah, I can't do that, it's gross. So, like, he did a terrible job of emulating Dexter. Especially because didn't Dexter only kill serial killers? He only killed, yeah, he only killed, like, criminals. I, so, I never watched the show, but yeah, that, that's like the gist.